Hello. Today I will try to develop a logic, a VSAP logic, that uh, prioritizes tram or public transport. I'm going to use the previous VSAP and VSIM model that I used for the for arm VSAP crossing with uh, tram. And we will consider how to deal with um, situations like this where you prioritize something and other stages can be dismissed so many times that the traffic that experiences very long waiting times. So let's have a look where to start. So first is basically what I want to do. I want to check for tram demand before any of the extension here. Um, if you remember in the poor file, we already include the minimum green time. So basically after stage active here, we can already start checking for it. And so what we want to do is we want to include a condition where we check for occupancy for the tram. So the tram has the detector port number five. And we say that if the detector uh, for the tram is zero, so there is no demand, then I will go on and deal with the stage as I did before. But if not, I move it to the fifth stage and then I just close it off. However, we don't have such an interstage because from one we only have to two. So what we do, I just basically copy paste as I showed it in the previous video. I just assume the same intergreen times here. Uh, I want to keep things simple. Um, so I just put it back to six because I should have copied this one. So this will be one to five and this is 12 and this is seven. So this is the seventh interstage and I just taking the number for the, from the normal one. And then I copy paste it again. I just change it. So when we go from one, we put um, we put A to red and we put E to green. You can check that here. So now this is the eighth. Then this we go from the second. So it will be B. Copy paste again. This is going to be ninth. We go from the third and it's going to be C. We already have a four to five. Yeah, here. So I just save this and it's done. Now I'm going to just copy the same thing for each uh, stage one to four because whenever the, wherever the logic is currently or the pointer in the DV swap, I want to just check for this occupancy anytime because I'm prioritizing the tram. So I just place the same statement here. I play, I put interstage. I just override it is from second to five. This is from third. This is from fourth. And I just close these off. Okay. So if I update now the model, and again here, I just left this occupancy because once the cycle is finished, I want to check once a demand on the fourth stage is over. I want to check, should I go back to one or shall I go to five? Okay. So I get my vehicle inputs 
and just put some small numbers here so not to not to do any issues with the model and the tram should have a very light input okay now if i run the model uh, i just need to basically save this okay let's see what happens it is circling through the stages back to one because there is no tram and the tram should come soon there is a tram and it goes okay so let me just increase the numbers here a bit maybe to 300 so there there will be some extensions hopefully yeah there are some extensions so when the tram comes the stage should be caught and it was caught early so the tram can tram could go so it is working fine just let's check one thing so what happens if i increase this tram to a very high number and let's say i also increase the car inputs you will see that something is missing from the logic <laughs> okay so now the tram comes now it goes back to one but immediately the tram uh, stage got called again and then it called again and if you see two three and four stage just there basically forever red so we need to deal with that what we can do uh, there are multiple ways to deal with it so you can place detectors and the or some detector on one arm or all the arms and like an end of queue and once that is reached it can trigger um, we can also check for occupancy on these how long the vehicles have been waiting on it and i think that's what i'm going to do because i don't want cars to wait therefore like you know over than, than three four minutes because then they will hit the red light so what i do i just first create a, a condition here in the middle in the start and i say that if occupancy on detector number one is more than 200 seconds or or on two or on three or on four so if basically what i say is if the if the occupancy is just too long vehicles been waiting for too long on any of the general traffic approach i'm going to um, change a variable let's say let's call it too much tram and i assign a value of one so if that happens i want to check that if there has been too much tram then i just make sure that i add another condition so if there is no occup if there is no occupancy on it or there has been too much tram like this in this case if either of these are true so if there is no demand or there is just too much tram then it will go and stay in the stage and it doesn't go down there so i just add this basically to everywhere and i will need to put this back to zero once this has been completed so what i need to do here i need to add in a new column and because if i pass this condition that means stage one two three and even four has been completely done 
because either max screen has been reached or the headway just um, too big, indicating no, uh, no further demand. So here I just put it back to zero. Um, there, when in Viswap you have a variable by default, that value is zero, as far as I'm aware. Um, so there is no need to initialize anything. But if there is a need, if you need to initialize for a different project or a different logic or something, the way you can do it is you create a condition and you can just use a dummy variable, I call it init, and if you say if it is zero, then basically you immediately put it back, put to another value, and then you can, then you can here add your functions, whatever you want to do to initialize, maybe to set up some signal behavior or something. Yeah, and let me just delete that. Okay, I save it, and let's give it a ride to see if it works. If not, we will fix the problems. Okay, so uh, good that it came up. So how can you fix these? Syntax error in line 24. So this it shows wap 216 dll So this is what shows the error, but the error is in the WAP file. This is just the DLL that does the error. So if you open the web file, you need to go to line 24, 49, and symbol read that instead of that. So I just made a type typo. I'm not going to open the VSWAP for yet. I just have a quick look, maybe I so here probably I need to add brackets as a starter. <laughs> okay. Like that. Okay, let's try now. Yeah, it is working. So it was just so simple as that. Okay, so let's wait until the traffic is building up. Now the tram is uh, maintaining the tram phase. That comes, tram is back, but we should reach the 200 seconds soon. So now, I think soon the tram will be stopped because too much tram will be one. So now it will cycle through all other stages and then the tram can go again. So now one comes and it runs all the way, even while there is a demand for tram. But as long as there is a short headway, it will go. And as long as the max green time has not uh, reached yet, has not been reached yet. And now the second stage, the third, and then the fourth will go. And then too much tram variable will be zero. So the tram dominance can restart. Of course, we have already used that 200 second on a few, probably stage one is already, um, this detector is already around 100 second, so you probably need to increase it to like 300. And now it's going, and then it's back. So, I hope this video helped you. Of course, this the amount of tram I used here, <laughs> and traffic is, is not realistic. But I wanted to show you how to deal with certain issues you might face. So I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions or recommendations in the comment sections, let's discuss. And if you want to support the channel, a like and subscribe costs you nothing. It would help me a lot. Or if you want to check out my Patreon page for extra support, I would appreciate that. You can find the link in the description. Thanks a lot for watching.